All right, it was pointed out to me that I lost this 10x, um, which does change my derivatives. All right, the answer I gave was correct, but the derivatives were missing a 10. All right, so the constraint of the first part of this problem, so this is the 7.5 part two, the correction to the first problem. The constraint's still the same. My x plus y has to equal $31.90. But when I wrote my profit function down in my Lagrange equation, I lost the 10 in front of the xy, uh, which would change the problem. Set that equal to zero, so that's minus 31. All right, so again, everything's the same, and the answer still comes out $20, like I gave in the original video, and $11.90, and the profit is all correct from the previous video. What was incorrect was my derivatives, all right? So because I was missing that 10x, my derivatives with respect to x should have been a negative 2x plus 10y, plus four lambda and that equal to zero and the derivative with respect to y should have been a negative 10y positive 10x so there's the parts that are missing the 10 in front of the x and the y so it's an x. two plus lambda equals zero the Lagrange or the derivative with respect to lambda was fine And so when I go plug it into the matrix, my matrix equation should have been negative 2x plus 10y plus lambda equals negative 4, uh, positive 10x. All right, so that's what's missing. Uh, minus 10y plus lambda equals negative 2x plus y equals 31.9. When you type that in, again, I was missing the 10s. So those were the tens that I was missing. All right, but since when I had written it out originally, I had written it out with the correct answer, uh, but when I was typing it up on the video, I wrote it down without the pen. The final answer that I gave you, because that's what was in my calculator, was correct. This matrix with the tens in the right spot does simplify to what I gave in the previous one. So this should have been 20, 11.9, and whatever the lambda was. I actually can't remember what the lambda was. All right, so that was correct. The mistake that I made was I copied down wrong. I missed the 10 on this term, which means in my derivatives, I missed those 10s. All right, but the answer, like I said, the answer was correct. So the original video, I have the answer is fine, and if I have a chance to redo the video, I will. Um, but this corrects it, alright? So everything else, I believe, should be fine.